Well, good evening. It's great to be here, and I'm delighted that you organized this evening. You may not be politicians, but you're not docile. You're fighting back. You're creative, dynamic, and resourceful, and that's so important at this time. I'd like to start on a personal note. I believe that arts and culture are key to our quality of life in our country and in our community. When a country has a strong identity, it can take care of itself. It can take care of its citizens. And when a community has strong cultural identity, it, is, it becomes dynamic and it becomes resourceful, as we're seeing tonight. And that's why, while I was a city councillor, I voted to increase the local arts funding. And as was mentioned, I spearheaded the proclamation for a creative learning city in Victoria. And I'd like to think that some of the work I did contributed to the growth of the arts community. It's for some of the reasons that I've just mentioned that the arts represent a threat to the Conservative and why New Democrats oppose their agenda to make over Canada to their personal tastes and sensibilities. The Conservative policy seems to come right out of the uh, Margaret Atwood's uh, Handmaid's Tale, where, and, and her story clearly shows us what happens when you erase history and you censor the arts and, and you leave uh, a, a society vulnerable to a mindless ideology. New Democrats will reverse the Conservative cuts, as well as the C-10 legislative changes that, uh, where the, the Conservatives arbitrarily restricted and censored uh, the, the funding, the public funding for, um, for artistic projects. And I have seen, I have heard of the impacts in this community from the Belfry, the Kaleidoscope, individual performing artists, the BC Museum, cuts to independent video and film producers. Jack Layton will be releasing our arts platform this week, but let me say very quickly tonight that we will enhance the funding for Canada Council. We will provide stable long-term funding to the CBC and Canadian film and television producers. We do intend to, in, to develop a national strategy for supporting Canadian museums, historic buildings, and heritage lighthouses. And I don't have time to tell you everything else, but it, I may have the opportunity later on. But measures of success, sustainability, talking to the community to see if the arts funding is working or not, and the economic ind indicators that have just come up are they going up or going down? That should tell us. Thank you very much.